Everything's been really empty. I know they're completely redoing the inside uh, and even some of the stores outside are closing down or remodeling. And now part of that remodeling includes an auction of what used to be the mall's food court now walled off for construction. Everything from the kids playground equipment to industrial ice makers and even the neon Rocky Rococo signs can be yours for a price. You can order food at home, you can play games at home, you can watch movies at home. Uh, why would you come to malls? So I think malls in general have to change their business uh, you know, uh, concept of why they exist. And that's part of the idea behind what's next for the Glendale Mall. Plans for Bayshore's revival include new use for the outdoor space, less retail, and the enclosed part of the mall demolished to make way for apartments, senior housing, and a hotel. Sad to see the steakhouse close, sad to see malls not growing. In general, malls are dying in America. I think uh, we need malls that can attract uh, you know, clients, families, engage kids. The auction company says there are more than 100 people registered already from some 30 states nationwide hoping to own a piece of Bayshore. Oh, it looks so different. All right, Ben, for people who are interested, how do they bid? Joyce, this is on a website called badgerauction.com. Those lots begin closing at 10.30 tomorrow morning. We do have a link to that up on our website right now, wisn.com and on the 12 News mobile app. Ben Wagner reporting live from Glendale.